Well, what it means is that Africa is innovating. Africa is moving quite quickly along the path of what was achieved in the past, past in terms of fintech technology. Uh, we've seen, of course, mobile money take off in a big way. Uh, Africa's hungry for innovation. Africa wants to leapfrog to the next level. In the area of uh, telecommunications, we've laid out very, uh, very impressive fiber optic cables that provides very smooth connectivity, very good bandwidth. This technology now has to be applied on that infrastructure that has been put in place. So for us, uh, as you know, we're, we're always looking to speed up transactions. Uh, the theme of this AIF is about speeding up among other things. Technology is key in that. And so it's not just about the speed in terms of days, but it's also about the efficiency and the turnaround time that uh, clients want to see more of. It's also about transparency. It's also about uh, improving um, the, uh, uh, the carbon footprint that is involved by cutting down trees and doing everything through, through paperwork as is classically done. So this is a very exciting uh, transaction. It's the first uh, sugar uh, trade finance deal that has been done through blockchain. But actually, it's also the very first blockchain-based trade finance deal done by any African DFI. So I think it's, uh, it's, it's a privilege for us to be able to announce this uh, here at the AIF when uh, we're all looking for uh, showcasing opportunities around speeding up. So this is really about speeding up. Well, I think uh, confidence is one because uh, when you see such levels of seriousness coming through various stakeholders, not just the heads of state or the bank CEOs who are you know, at the forefront of pushing the AIF uh, initiative. But when you look at all the other partners, the numbers of people who've come from almost 100 plus countries, very exciting. And it just shows that there's a lot of interest in Africa. The, the investment agenda that we launched last year is looking very promising. Uh, there is a lot of appetite for Africa. And I think what we're doing is we're, we're opening the eyes of uh, many interested investors to the opportunities that are available. And so for me to see uh, AIF2 uh, come out stronger, bigger and better is co confirmation that it was the right thing to do.